Good morning. Got a taste test. Gluten-free, funfetti cupcakes. Oh, ooh, cute. Just a minute. Let me get Actually, the Actually, these have cream cheese icing on them, so it probably doesn't matter what the cupcake tastes like. We'll see. Cream cheese icing. Ooh, an ugly Christmas sweater day at work. We're having a Christmas party. Ooh, yay, Grinch kebabs. They're so cute. <laughs> You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Hey, hey guy. I had to change my shirt. The other one got so hot. Anyway, time for buddy reads. I have the beekeeper that I'm starting today, Rescuing the Stolen Women of Iraq by Dunya McHale. I'm reading this with Patrice. And the Mary Stewart of the month, which is Nine Coaches Waiting. And this one I think is a favorite of a lot of people and it's a little chunkier than most. So, starting that one today too. Gotta run. These fields sure are festive this time of year. <laughs> We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Are you dancing, guy? <laughs> you doing the Jingle Bell Rock? <laughs> what is that face? Hey. <laughs> I think he's done with that. got your workout in now you're gonna relax <laughs> cats are funny creatures uh -uh. no 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 not my well shark your brother is a bad boy you might need to kick his butt again oh you better stop looking at that tree you a bad boy kitty cat I'm looking at you All fun and games till the whale shark gets mutilated. Kitty cats are exhausted from their shenanigans. <laughs> Gabriel found me a gluten free section right next to kids and babies. Let's see what I can find here. What do you think you're gonna get? I'm thinking the pepperoni looks good, but. It does look good. Principal's giving us pepperoni for lunch on Friday. I can eat pizza every day for every meal. <laughs> Wait now. We might have to think about this. Should I should I do dare I try? Off brand mac and cheese? This is a little too off brand to me. Going for broke. Better be good. We're on the prowl for cozy reading night snacks. There might not be much cozy reading going on, but we're gonna get the snacks. Popcorn cakes. Huh. Should I try rice cakes too? With stocking stuffers. Isn't Gabriel to the car so Santa could finish the shopping because because Santa's had enough of people and shopping. Santa ain't coming back here till Christmas is over. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. And I'm really done. This is worthy of Christmas gift giving, y'all. Maybe one more stocking stuffer. I don't care if I forgot anything, I'm done. Absolutely done. Got special delivery. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at that. It's a It's a, um... Smartphone stand. That's gonna be cool. 
I don't know what happened over the weekend, but my reading seems to have tanked. I need to find my mojo. Good morning. It's Thursday. One more wake up until Christmas vacation for me. I finished this last night. It was so good. I was listening to it on audio for about a week and it just it got so good at the end I mean what am I it was good the whole way but you know it got real pacey at the end where you just had to know how it ended had to so I ended up ditching the audiobook around um, nine o'clock last night in power reading the end so yeah I stayed up till after 11 so <laughs> that tells you how good it was so yeah if you are interested in a well-paced page turner of a read southern lit mystery historical but in the 60s um, and characters that you absolutely fall in love with and gorgeous nature, gorgeous nature. This could well be your next read. And now, what should I work on today? I think I need to catch up in this one. Yes, Buddy Reed for the win. I got my sister's package ready. Look at my new sloth wrapping paper. Train. So it is Thursday night or late afternoon. Still no. <clears throat> and I haven't read a darn thing all day. Gabriel and I just got back from a little top secret adventure, probably involving books. Yeah, but my game, my rules, right? Anyway, I'm not going to admit to it till January. Um, but I got a couple books for my little littlest niece, and I think I'm going to read them this evening. Still no. So I will have something to talk about tomorrow for Friday Reads. But I got Rosie Revere Engineer. How cute is that? And I will try to get a little clip of my blondie niece. Uh, in Florida, she's so cute, and this reminds me of her so much. Um, so yeah, I saw this on Riley's channel from RM Thick Facts. She got it for her niece for Christmas, and I just had to order it. And then um, I also got Jen Campbell, her Franklin's Flying Bookshop. Um, she sent me the sequel last month. That just released and it is gorgeous um, but I hadn't read the first one yet so oh my gosh look how beautiful that is so I'm gonna read this and I think I think it's gonna be perfect because Jim Campbell's use of words is just perfect um, and just I think this little girl's gonna be so spirited both of these little girls so yeah that's that's my plan I'm gonna read these and the sequel as well um, and let you know what I think tomorrow. And I think I will go ahead and sign off on this one so I can post it and then I'll be 20 for 20 with Vlogmas and still know. Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon. Bye.